Next on the Speedway, driver who has been exceptional at Slick when he's qualifying with the World of Outlaws NOS Energy Drink Sprint Car Series. From Watertown, Connecticut, in the Houston Speedway Building and Automotive, Jackson Motor Cup's high performance group against KRC Transportation. Number two, David Gravel. David Gravel in car number two, 2016 winner here in Peavely. Lap number one is 19th quick at a 10, 834-10834. Second lap time for David Gravel is better in a 16th quick at a 10, 737, and quick, and the green flag is waving, and we are underway at Federated Auto Parts Raceway at I-55. In the turn one, Sheldon Hunt, Sheldon Tom Rico, Avery down low. Avery's got the lead, battle for the third one. Brock's here, Frost takes it away from the number eight of Aaron Rachel. Three wide, battle for fourth out of turn four. Rachel nearly gets into this here, Frost. David Gravel trying to take advantage down low on the speedway. Gravel finds right Rachel to take over the fourth spot. Aaron Rachel looks back to the inside, but can't make the move into quarter number three. Rico Avery shows the way. Rachel again back to the inside of David Gravel. And that is the 83 junior of Kerry Madsen sitting sideways on the top in corner number two. Back underway. Gravel again looks to the inside of Reitzel, trying to make a move of the 20 G of Noah Gast. A little sideways out of turn number two for the number two of David Gravel. Noah Gast trying to capitalize and steal the final transfer spot. Gast a peek to the inside, can't make the move out of turn four. David Gravel once again on the attack, coming after the eight of Aaron Reitzel, trying to wrest the fourth spot away. That one pass for position worth four starting spots in tonight's feature. Halfway home, five in the books, five to go in the first of four heat races. Gravel again with another run on Aaron Reitzel, makes the move to the inside. Reitzel trying to stay in the line, and he'll hold the position. Again, these two have been waging war all race long. David Gravel again with another run on Reitzel down the back straightaway. Seven laps down for your race leader, Rico Abreu, his lead one and a quarter seconds over the 17 of Sheldon Hodenshield. Gravel continuing to try to find a way by the number eight of Aaron Reitzel. Gravel comfortably in the final transfer now as he has pulled some distance between himself and the 20G of Noah Gass. It's a heat race victory. Sheldon Hodenshield finishes in the second spot. Rox here, Foss third at the line. The fourth spot will go to Aaron Reitzel who just barely hangs on over David Gravel. All right, guys. So I forgot to do the video before the night started, but we're about halfway through. Uh, track was rough, got canceled night one of uh, Friday night for here at Peavely, but we're here Saturday back racing finally. It rained a little bit Friday night, and uh, now we're, we're back racing Saturday, thank God. Uh, sucks we can't get two races in this weekend. It's uh, three weekends in a row we've lost a race on Friday, but um, so far we're uh, struggling a little bit qualifying. We are 21st quick. Um, just got through the holes really good in hot laps and uh, just did not get through them good in qualifying. It's a little bit of luck, a little bit of skill, a little bit of handling, you know, just uh, just getting through those holes the right way. And the first lap, it spit me out. Uh, got through one and twos almost all the way through and right at the last second, it kicked me out. And then uh, the second lap, I tried to arc my corner more and I just got too high in the rough stuff and uh, hurt my speed. So uh, we start uh, sixth in heat number one ran fifth so uh, we start I think 17th in the future tonight so we're gonna be battling tonight for a good run but uh, as long as we stay clean and uh, have a solid car here I think we'll still be able to get a strong run here tonight the tracks getting wider um, I think uh, we'll be okay so looking forward to the future guys we'll talk to you after the feature is over and you know let's uh let's get at least get a top 10 let's maybe try to squeak towards the top five that's my goal and uh, we're gonna keep fighting tonight and not give up. So we'll talk to you guys after the night's over. It's a chilly one. I'm excited to get home tomorrow for Easter. So let's uh, finish the weekend off strong. Thank you guys. We are green in Peavely. Feature action underway as they race into turn one. Sheldon Hodge show a little bit of a bite there. Loses a couple of spots, but able to hang on. Meanwhile, side by side for the lead. Down low, Carson Pacino slides in front of Logan Shore. Shore crosses underneath him, but Carson Pacino leads the opening lap. Logan Shore and Messino, another three wide battle into turn three and four. Car 
slowing in one of... We're back on... Oh, Sheldon Hodenshield upside down in turn number four. Contact as they came to the green flag. Broken front axle, I believe, on number 17. The front axle was askew before he ever turned over onto his side. Corner of Carson Macedo's car. The race leader may have damage to the right rear corner as we go back to green. Macedo continues to lead down low. Logan Schuhart closes in, now makes the move to the inside of the speedway. Not enough room for the slider. J-Mac right there as well. McFadden on sweet part of the mix. McFadden to the inside of Schuhart looking for second. Sheldon Hodenshield up to eighth now. Sheldon Hodenshield back up into the top ten and looking for more. Keeping an eye on Carson Macedo's car. Potential damage there. Now, Sweet and McFadden continue their battle. They race for the third spot. Sweet in the middle. McFadden down low out of turn four. Sheldon Hodenshield to the inside of David Gravel. Looking for Donnie Shots now. They battle for the sixth spot. Macedo trips up the racetrack and turn four down low. Logan Schuhart, he is right there in traffic. Right, the wheel has come off of Jimmy Miller's car. The left rear wheel is off the 51B. Caution flag, and it happened right in front of Logan Schuhart. Underway one more time at Federated Auto Parts Raceway at I-55. Brad Sweet's got a run on James McFadden. Now makes the move to the inside, racing for the third spot. The Big Cat slides up the banking. Logan Schuhart a little crossed up in turn number two. Sheldon Hodgson to the inside of Rico Avery. Sheldon back into the top five now. Bicycle by James McFadden. He gathers it back in, but that allows Sheldon Hodgson to close. Sweet all over Schuhart racing for second. Lucino still holds the lead. Sheldon Hodgson now racing up to James McFadden. Looks to the inside in turn one. Sheldon with the big move. He has got the fourth spot back. Sheldon Hodgson was upside down earlier. He's now back in the fourth. Sheldon a bobble on the cushion. Now J-Mac back into the fourth spot. A tap to the back bumper by Sheldon as they race down the front straightaway. Sheldon Hodgson gets over the back end of the 83. He gathers it back in. Two to go for Carson Macedo. Sheldon once again closing in on James McFadden. Makes the move to the inside. Sheldon Hodgson back to fourth. Not for long. J-Mac right back to the inside. White flag waving for the 41. And Logan Schuhart's gotten closer in traffic. They race down the back straightaway for the final time. Schuhart may have a chance here. Logan Schuhart in the traffic in three and four. Won't be able to make a move. It will be Carson Macedo getting the win. All right, guys, made it to the hotel. It is now 1.30. The night is over. I got to park my T-shirt trailer, r, r Enterprises. They do a lot of my T-shirt designs. Got to thank them for the hospitality, for letting me park my rig at their place, and also give me a ride to the hotel, and then I catch a shuttle in the morning. But uh, I got a 7 a.m. flight. I'll be on the shuttle at 6 a.m., uh, so I'll be sleeping for about three and a half, four hours. Um, get up early, get a little breakfast, and uh, head home for Easter. But, um, man, like I said before in the video, the night did not start off well. Um, started 17th in the A main, and we fought hard, guys. We actually got to the top 10, I think, in three or four laps. Uh, one guy crashed, um, really made some hay on the restarts, and uh, there's obviously a lot of crashes. But I uh, was able to pass a lot of guys around the bottom of the racetrack, and the, the car felt really, really good. Um, got to about ninth or 10th and uh, kind of hung out around there past Donnie, past Jacob, got to 7th, uh, was racing with Rico, past Rico, got up to 6th uh, and was really right there for like 4th fourth, fourth through 7th and I was pretty close. Um, very happy to finish 7th with that type of racetrack. Obviously something that I'm probably not the best at or have enough courage to just drive like an absolute maniac i definitely try to finish races so um to get seventh from starting 17th we got the kscr charger so that was good to end we wanted to end the night off with a top 10 rolled in the box not be in the work area and that's what we did so um to reward myself on uh, a successful night in the feature i got myself some cheetos mac and cheese which is Probably the Easy Mac probably makes this. And, uh, yeah, we got Cheetos flavor. So that's what I'm eating for dinner. I'm going to get washed up, sleep for three and a half hours, fly to see my family. My parents are in town, and I got big news. By the time you guys see this video, the news will be out. But I'm going to be a father. Um, something 
that I've always wanted to do. Um, I'm married. Kid is next. I have a house. And uh, we're very excited. We're expecting in October, mid to late October. Uh, me and Jill have been together a long time. We've always wanted kids. And uh, this is the right time for us. So looking forward to going home tomorrow and doing our gender reveal and reveal to everybody to the world. So looking forward to that, guys. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy this video. I did some different camera angles. One of my GoPros did mess up. So... I think we didn't get too much footage from the feature on my side camera, but I believe my camera facing forward got everything. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you very much. Uh, T-shirt trailer was busy tonight. Uh, appreciate all the love from you guys. Everybody that stops by, sign and die cast cars, all those things. So, um, please like this video. Give this uh, video a thumbs up. Ring the bell for notifications. Check out shopdgr.com, guys. Please subscribe to the channel. Check out my TikTok. Um, been doing TikToks here for a little bit and uh, trying to build that up. So thank you guys very much. I'm going to enjoy Easter with my family. I hope you guys do as well. And uh, we'll see you next week. Peace out.